Hello everyone, this is me, Sakya here, and I'm back with another reading, which is going to be a bonus love read. I will be doing this reading for three signs, Pisces, uh, Aries, and Scorpio. Uh, this reading is going to be for the sign of Pisces, as they got the most views, and then the second highest was for the sign of Aries, and the third one was for the sign of Scorpio. So yeah, this reading is going to be for the sign of Pisces, so let's see what is coming up for my fishies for their love life in the coming days and weeks time. Um, I will be adding uh, oracle cards in this reading, plus uh, we might include message cards from your person as well. So stay tuned and uh, before I dive into the read, let me remind you it is a general read, it may, it may not resonate with uh, everyone out there, so always pick the signs and messages which are resonating with you in your situation and leave the rest. For personal reads, you can always reach out to me on my email ID in the description box. You can check the further services that I offer as well in the description box. So fishies, let's find out what can you expect in your love life in coming uh, weeks and um, days time. So let's see what can you expect happening for you in your love life with your specific someone. Even if you are single, you can still watch this reading. Let's see what can you expect coming up for you in the week's time. <clears throat> let's begin. Wow, Ace of Cups. Wow. If you are single, trust me, something beautiful is coming your way. With the Ace of Cups, it's, a, it's like a person who's going to fulfill your emotional needs, who's going to love you like you always wanted to be loved. Um, if it's a past person who is coming with something emotional, uh, you know, and uh, committed to offer, then too it's, it's just gonna fulfill your heart with a lot of happiness i feel like you know you you are going to definitely experience some major shift in your love life where your wishes fulfilled life is definitely um here for you like you know where you are happy with your person where you are excited uh to jump into a new future with your specific someone to start a new chapter in your love life with your person i feel like you know with the help of divine uh, with the with the blessings of uh, divine, I feel like you know you are getting some um, some major shift in your love life. Whether you are single, whether you are you know having issues with your person, whether you are having no communication with your person, something beautiful is going to happen for you. For a majority of you, where you're gonna start feeling, oh my God, like you know you're gonna feel like you know as if. Uh, Whatever you've been praying, affirming for, is here now. Let's see more cards here. Judgment. Yes, your prayers are heard. Um, and you are getting your uh, wishes fulfilled now by the heavens. Um, for some of you, maybe you are going to see yourself uh, waiting, wishing, hoping for, for something beautiful. Uh, where you want the divine to bring you what you know the kind of love that you wish for so for some of you you might be like you know aligning yourself to receive that abundance for others of you you might be praying for that kind of love why because you are done with the toxic relationships you are done with all the negative things that uh, your current relationships bring you in your life you want happiness you want fulfillment you want abundance so maybe um, it's, it's more like you know the moment you decide that this is what you are aiming for this is what you are looking for the universe is going to bring you opportunities possibilities ways to to have that kind of love life if your person has been kind of you know unavailable to you they will start giving into the connection because they will see the change coming from your end towards them um, and they will know that they have to give you the love or else they will lose you which they will never choose to uh, you know risk so I feel like you know you are definitely getting um, many steps ahead with your person in your love life for sure let's see more cards here the hangman and the last card is Ten of Swords. The weight is over. Last, uh, this card also wants to come up. So let's take that one as well. The Strength underneath the deck. We do have the Six of Cups. You are getting your childhood dream fulfilled. You are getting your love uh, of your life. You are getting the kind of uh, relationship that you always wanted. I feel like you know it took a long period of time for you to have what you are going to get in the coming weeks time. It's something that you prayed, affirmed, wished for. You stayed strong around it. You never lost your hope around it. You are worthy of love. You are deserving of love. You are worthy of the kind of relationship that you want. And that's exactly what is showing up in your reality. The moment you understand that, the moment you realize that, the moment you kind of you know um believe in yourself and you know that you are worthy of that kind of love 
the universe is bestowing you with this beautiful energy is coming up for you in your love life. Let's see Oracle cards first and then we will uh, pull out some messages from your person. Um, it can be a new person, it can be a past person, it can be the current person as well. But yes, in your love life, you are definitely going to see some major shifts happening. Luck is on your side. Definitely it is. Um, a time to give rather than take. Um, I feel like you know, it's time for you to give time to yourself rather than uh, taking out time for other people. Uh, the more you're going to spend your time feeling loved is going to bring you more love into your life. So make sure you do that. Don't let pride get in your way. Um... I feel like, you know, it's a... Uh, I feel like, you know, it's a message for your person, though. Maybe it's a message for a cross-watcher there. You know, it's time for them to give you rather than taking love from you. So you have to be on the receiving end. I feel like, you know, this message here is for my fishies. Luck is on your side. Definitely it is. When it comes to the delays and when it comes to the person that you are dealing with, if they have been holding themselves back in the pride of... Uh, or in the ego of uh, theirs, I feel like you know, it's high time that they have to give in to the connection or else they are going to lose you. Because I do see you very strong around the love life that you have or that you desire in your, in your, in your life. So I feel like you know, your person is going to have, uh, you know, put the pride aside, put the ego aside and give in to the connection. Because I feel like you know, this is not you. This is not for, you know, this is not your energy biases. So it could be the energy of the person that you are dealing with and then the universe really wants you to know that it's time for your person to um, get the pride aside and give in to the connection because it's time for you to receive. It's time for you to stop, um, you know, begging for your person to give you time and energy and, you know, to love you. It's time for you to enjoy what the heavens are bringing you to have, to enjoy, to, uh, to bestow you with. It's very important for you to understand that you don't have to chase a person, you don't have to... Uh, let the person treat you bad. You just have to believe and that's all you need to do right now to have what you desire. It's your person's time to put effort into the connection. That's very important for you to understand. Let's see the messages from your person. Let's see what do they want you to know. <clears throat> Major blessings are coming for sure. Luck is on your side and you are going to be getting uh, your love life wish fulfilled. So, yeah, let's what is the message from your person let's see i no longer let people influence my life i have changed so maybe your person really wants you to know that they don't let people influence them now for those of you who have been uh having issues with your person because of the third party situation be that their family be that their uh friends be that their work uh people be that their close uh, you know friend circle if they have been influencing your person uh lately i feel like you know your person is no longer getting influenced by other people they think for themselves that you know uh they, uh, they follow their heart now, so they really want you to know that. And uh, they are not going to get stopped by the people around them. I am trying to work on my mental blocks. They are right now trying to work on their mental blocks, be that around this connection, be that around this commitment issue, be that around you know taking things to the next level. If they have been having issues, if they have been having mental blocks, they really want you to know that they are working towards uh, you know it and they want to get rid of it very soon. Let's see more cards here. What else are their messages? I need more time to think through and figure things out for myself. They really want some more time. Let them have the time that they want. And while you wait, you have to stay strong. You don't have to uh, let the delay get the best of the situation. Try to work on yourself, work on your uh, happiness. Do the things that make you happy while you wait because the wait is going to get over very soon. All you need to do is to believe, to affirm, to, uh, to stay positive, to visualize, to, uh, to act as if you already got it all. Because I don't see that you are in a situation where your person is, no, uh, you know, is not interested in you. They want exactly the same thing as you want with them. Just that uh, they have some mental blocks to get rid of and uh, once they are done with that, they will be coming to give you what you want because the universe has your back. The universe has heard your prayers. So you don't have to do anything now. All you need to do is to stay happy and to stay excited. To be on the receiving end of what you have asked for. And the universe is going to bring you that. Let's see some more cards underneath the deck. Uh, we do have six of cups underneath that page of wands. Underneath that the ten of cups. You are very close to get your emotional fulfillment with your specific someone in your love life. So that's pretty much it uh, coming up for you for this read. If it helped you, do like, share and subscribe if you are willing to purchase any of the services that I offer, affirmations or any other techniques that I offer, you can check the description box for further details on that. So yeah, uh, till I do the next reading for you guys, take care and bye-bye.